Because now we're looking at a Kennen here as the last pick. They say, oh, it's going to be the Aatrox in the top lane. Well, and we're going to throw this Kennen up there. Have bar, so this has to once again just accept defeat there. Canyon in the spot, but score in for the counter gank. He's still here. Doesn't have vision on Canyon. Hitter just gonna dodge that one. Now to turn it with the TP. Here we go. The Silas coming on in, but they're trying to turn it around now. A score goes in, but he's gonna be punished for that one. It's now BDD going one before here. Snowflower is too low. KT, they gotta get out of this one. A Snowflower is gonna go down as well. And Showmaker here still on the chase. See if he can get on into this one. Nice little dodge there from BDD here. As now down one with their lead, are going to push on to the mountain drink here. Canyon is going to smite that one down. Side looking for a kick. There's a lot to like for Canyon in the bottom lane. He's looking for it now as the kick into the charm. Oh, beautiful. See you later as it's super clean from the side of position, but BDD has to blow his real flash to get away from that one. But Canyon waiting in the wings here. Gonna get the double knock up here as maybe down one went too far. KT able to pick up one and the TP now coming in as they want more and Barrel super low gets dunked down by the Aatrox of Smith. Punished. Nice punishment from KT. Down one to use that teleport. They don't want to give up Rift Arrow. Yeah, now Score gonna have to give up his life here as he went a little bit too deep. In Probably a symptom of the double flash at level one for KT. Down one. Canyon just really wanted that red buff, and it looks like he may be punished here, but no, Dalmon looking to turn it around. Score getting really low, has a nice stopwatch, but now Nuggery in the back line is gonna zone everybody away, and Snowflower alone can't do the damage, but uh -oh. here's Feb. The Aatrox is gonna get into that back line. Can he do the damage? BDD is gonna help out in a big way. The Ignite and the Minions will be enough to clean that one up. It's a very prey or veteran thing to say. Yep, we got those kills. What are we going to do with them? Apparently fight more. Okay, we're going in again, as that's what Rakan likes to do. But they don't get Snowflower, actually. And Prey and Pre Score. Sick Wombo once it does come down to it as Nuclear. He's just been chilling in the bottom lane the entire time as, oh boy, uh -oh. on a ward here's Showmaker and one more auto might have done it if not for that one. But the flash forward and an extra one is going to be enough as Barrel. BDD is able to style on him. But now there's two members of Dom one make it three actually as they were looking to hand that kill over and a dive in the top lane. But it's a trade over as Nuggery takes out score. It's a hard one for you, Valdez. I know. Everywhere <laughs> they're finding the observers like, what's going on here? We have to hire more observers if the meta changes like this. That one pushes through the mid lane. Pushing, taking down the turret. The usual glacial pace. Things like going on at once. You know, BDD goes deep, but then they get the trade kill, and they decide to group up as four as Score gets out of position, trying to go down. Uh, yeah. on Gaming thinking better of it. Let's keep rolling. Who's to say we can't import metas? Because this one is feeling like the fiesta people want. Oh, Showmaker, though, he has a proto bell, but it's not enough to create any distance. Nuclear immediately. And uh, GSS, it looks like, on that one. It's now Smep going to get in the back line, but here's the Wombo combo. They get the Darwin, and they get another one, but the Smeb is going to help out in the damage. And so far, Dominic able to turn it around nicely, but can they get out of here alive is the question. Looks like for now, oh. maybe, but oh, that oh, hero. Real. Any fight where they force out the enemy and Zoe and Ezreal are healthy enough to tell tales about It's his younger brother, Snap. Here he goes into the back line and a big Wombo actually on top of him. He can't find that kill and down he will go and now Snowflower is going to get baited into it as well. He mentioned that duo of Ezreal and Zoe left alive, but... It's five on three now. It was just a, definitely a very snap moment. He just gets in there, but he goes in like he's old Aatrox. He's not, and now Dom will want more. All right, we're not wasting any time. He's here. into it as Nuggery wraps around from the back and finds the kill. As, oh boy, BDD, what's going on here? He gets the trouble bubble and actually the blasting plants, but the flash on in and the double knockup means that we're gonna have an ace, guys. All five members of Dom One are gonna survive. Stuck in there. Yeah. Dom One Gaming outplay them. Aatrox's mistake. That spillage is gonna burn all of KT Rolster and shut Gage on it with the cannon, with the Silas, with the Rakan. You actually do need a Nico or something like that. 
the fact that he's done that and actually pulled off the flanks, not something we usually associate with him, is the team's walking. He's actually a level behind Smeb, who I guess was looking for a team fight roam. Smeb continues to retire. All KT can do is grin and bear it. They need to poke before they fight. They get a trouble bubble here on Tanuguri, who has to uh, Zonya's early, so they're forcing the fight here. Tanuguri gonna stay alive, but Downey does go right at the end, and now Nuclear, way out of position here, he's gonna go down, and maybe KT can turn this somehow, as Beryl and everybody is on the run here. Score trying to chase okay. after him, but he's gonna get baited into that one, but Showmaker getting pretty low, but now Canyon trying to make things interesting on the prey. Showmaker still alive in the back line here. Dredge line is gonna miss a kick towards his allies actually means that Showmaker oh. is gonna go down. Nice follow up there from Prey. Wasted to take a Baron for the team of KT Rolster. A lot of question mark. KT's question at every moment. Spab's uh -oh. gonna check the with his face. And uh, that means he's probably gonna die here as he is gonna ult here. In the end, gets a big knockup, but you just can't build through that one. That's all here for score, but being zoned out by Beryl, and they don't have vision. Doesn't look like it's going to be enough as they get the knockup now onto the back line. A big uh, ultimate there from the side of the Silas takes that one away from Snowflower. They get the double kill, and now the rest of KT just on the run after they give away another Baron to the side of Dom One Game. And Zaya brings up the mini whip. Can they just win on this push? Feels like a Doom push, Valdez. Absolutely does. Is trying to read that one. Is not going to be the case. Showmaker with a fantastic Nautilus all the last time around. But the push continues here as okay. Trying to get that kick. Prey able to be away from that one. Another cannon coming in here that they can use with the Baron. And not too much time on the death timers. They gotta go now if they want to, but the fear on the minions by Smeb trying to push him away. As they're trying to engage the big time into the back line of Prey. They should be able to get him here. And Smeb also in the stopwatch just barely trying to hold on to this game. But they're going to target the Nexus and try to end it as fast as possible. Can they though? As the big cataclysm in the back line. But it's not enough. As Dom1 will be able to pick up game three. They 